Always remember, your life is not a fairy tale. No. Oh, it's hard to forget, Jeff. If Thanks. you lose your shoe at midnight, uh -huh. you're just drunk. Yeah, that's true. Oh, okay? probably, and this yeah. segment's no fairy tale either. It's just brutally honest truth. Oh. During a brand new edition of What's on Your Mind, yeah. we're going to start things off with Brooke. Brooke, what's on your mind? Uh, well, not a lot. Um, I may have, or my husband may have opened some mail that could or could not be maybe for new traffic violation. What? Oh, four I of them? Just... Did you say four new traffic violations? <sighs> It's the bridge, okay? Listen, it's I the know bridge is the bridge is an God. issue for me. It has been for a long time. Brooke. And some people like to drive really slow, like the speed limit. So <laughs> I, when I come in in the morning, there's this whole open lane. And sure, it may say bus only. Oh. But I don't see any buses. I see no buses. And they take yeah. photos of that? Yes! Oh, what? Who knew? What? I did not know that. No, I do. <laughs> Say, say cameras enforcing <laughs> rules. I got a couple of photographs of me and my car. No. All right. Oh no. I would like though to thank the warning system because there, is none. there are four warnings that I just got. Oh, what? they're with their own warnings. They're all warnings. warnings. Oh. I don't know. Maybe they just put the camera in, and so they're letting people know oh. that the camera's there. Lucky. Yeah, so I think it's a victory. My husband still thinks it's breaking a rule. <laughs> and you're like in the system. I now. tried to remind him that nobody in history gets remembered for following rules. You know? Yeah. So if you're listening right now, the traffic laws don't apply for your first four fails. <laughs> I'll be your warning to your warning. Oh so, my wow. gosh. Thank you for your non sacrifice. Yeah. Well, I just great. to let you know I may be late to work because I'm no longer able to use that lane. Um, uh, Jose, what's been on your mind? Well, over the weekend, I ordered some delivery food, and I got a really interesting message from the driver while they were on the way. Oh. Okay. So, someone named Dakota, and they don't have a profile picture. Okay. Yeah. But they messaged, and it said, hello, may I please have $1 or maybe $5 for huh? fuel? I apologize to ask. Oh, uh, okay. So immediately, I'm like, well, of course. Like, I remember I used to have to borrow money from people all yeah. the time, even when I first worked here. What do you do, tip through the app then, and then... Well, that's what I told them I was going to do. But here's what happens. The order takes really long, but eventually... Because uh, they got to get gas. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> eventually, yeah, it was sketchy. They get there, I get a message that says that they're at my apartment. So I go downstairs, and I see the food on the counter, and I run outside immediately, and I see that there's a guy outside looking at his phone yeah and so i'm like hey hey, hey brother here go get some gas and I, gave him a, and I gave him the 20 dollar bill okay. okay so he looks shocked and he's like wow thank you good deed done yeah. yeah and then i start to think and i go wait a minute i never asked if that person was dakota oh you just assume oh, the just guy assume? on the phone well, yeah and then i look at the app there's no picture oh, of a dakota yeah. so at this uh -huh. point i think uh -huh. i ran outside and gave some picked a random kid with a phone uh -huh. and was like here go put some gas in your tank and i ran away and they were like wow they thanks. played it off really well though. <laughs> he, wow. he looked shocked he was like wow thank you okay oh my god so well, you well, were that person you're, you're welcome you're welcome i filled yeah. your tank or yeah. half of it and you're gonna get a really bad review from your yeah. driver <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that guy promised to tip yeah. me. <laughs> oh, my God. Alexis, what's been on your mind? Well, so I took my roommate's car to work today. Oh, wow. Um, okay. And over the weekend, I biked everywhere I needed to go. And last wait. week, I got rides to work uh, oh, every day at the end of the week. Oh, no. Wait, you thank you. Your car? No one I, for noticing. Wait. Yeah. I may have accidentally totaled my car. Oh, no. no. Yeah. I, How? I'll show you a photo um, oh, of no. my car. You can pass oh. around. The rear end, so it wasn't your no, fault. No, I may have rear ended someone badly. But so everyone's okay. Bad. Everyone's okay. Yeah, what did they why? do to you to make Dude. you want to rear end them? <laughs> Long story short, I am going to get a check though for the damage. That's good. And honestly, like, I had more damage beforehand also. Yeah. So I think it's kind of a win because I'll make more this way than selling. Oh, yes. Oh, so it's yeah. kind of a hustle. Because, mm -hmm. yeah. That's how that girl math works. Yeah, yeah. like, they don't know yeah. the crack on the windshield already there. The door dent's already there. Oh, I didn't okay. say no. Oh, that, no. I mean, when it's all rusted, they know that it's been there for <laughs> no, a while. No, Brooke, I don't think 
so okay. Well, I haven't got the check yet, but yeah. I'm sure it'll be decent. Okay. I will it's be. Kind of yeah. smart. Like, Hopefully, no one at the insurance company listens to our yeah. show. So oh, that they okay. find yeah. I mean, yeah, yeah all right. those right. happen very fresh. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Everyone's on your mind. Well, the other day, we did a segment on the show about the one who got away. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I told our producer, I don't really have that. Yeah. But then I thought about it more. Oh. And I remembered there actually is somebody. Wait, you forgot oh, about the one who got away? It was a long time ago when uh -huh. I was growing up in L.A. Yeah. A young and confused man walking the streets of Hollywood. Oh. I was convinced at the time, <laughs> no uh -huh. joke, that I was destined to meet and fall in love with Hillary Duff. Oh, oh bro, I feel you, man. Hundred <laughs> percent so for sure that mm -hmm. was going to happen. Yeah. And I didn't think it was crazy because I used to hang out at the shopping center where all the celebrities and the stars oh, yeah. and their families would right. go to hang. So you'd like follow the paparazzi photos and see where <laughs> Hillary Duff was last. No, I mean I would just be there. I oh, would yeah, hang out yeah, there yeah, anyway, yeah. and I thought for sure we would meet randomly at the yeah. Cold Stone Creamery. Of course. Oh, yeah, and like yeah. she would walk in, we'd make eye contact uh -huh. from across like the ice <laughs> yeah. cream bar. Did you get diamonds on your toppings too? I would I would say something smooth when she was standing in line behind yeah. me like so oh, no. you doing waffle cone girl <laughs> and then instantly oh, yeah. in love with you yeah, yeah, i heard no. i bet you were a duff magnet oh yeah. you know? i would have been yeah. and then we would have like split a scoop of french vanilla yeah. gone lick for lick on that and then oh, just yeah, fallen yeah, in dude. love right there yeah well but she never came into that cold stone wow. so oh, hillary is... duff is my one who got away that was a beautiful story oh, yeah wow. i just I'm, I'm close to tears right now well look yeah. you, you guys want to get her on the phone for my birthday oh, yeah. and surprise me with her yeah she's okay. married but it's never <laughs> too late for okay. true love uh, i got your back bro i bet we can find her on cameo oh yeah, yeah. all right <laughs> surprise me with it i'll act like i totally didn't see it okay. coming on my birthday she's like hey jeff are you the weird guy from cold stone when yeah. we were younger i'll <laughs> never <Maybe> tell <laughs> That was What's On Your Mind. Oh Text in God. 78592. <laughs> Tell us what's been on yours. It's Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning.